Good morning, students. Today I am going to teach you lesson number nine, Raja the Faithful Dog. Raja the Faithful Dog. Before going to the chapter, let's see how to pronounce the word I C N E T. L I C K lick. K I C K kick. P E T pet. W E T wet. Now let's start our chapter. Raja is a pet dog. You can see him with his master in the picture. So this one is a story about Raja. Raja is a pet. Pet means domestic animal or bird. So pet in Hindi pet means paltu. So paltu kutta. So Raja is a pet dog. You can see you can see in this picture. This one is Raja. Pet dog and this one is his master. He helps his master and goes everywhere with him. His master cannot go out alone for he is blind. So Raja he always help his master wherever he wants to go. Raja he go with him because his master is blind. Blind means andha, so he cannot go out alone. When the master wants to go out for a walk or to visit his friends, he whistles to Raja. Raja at once runs to him with his lead in his mouth. So whenever the master, Raja's master, he wants to go outside or or he wants to go for a walk or visit his friend, he whistles to Raja. Whistle. Whistle means city. City bajana. So he whistled to Raja, and when the Raja he heard the whistle, he ran to him with his lead. Lead, L E A D. Lead means rope for guiding. Rope means rassi. So he 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 come with his rope in his mouth. His master puts the lead onto Raja's belt. He hold the other end of the lead. After that, when the Raja he brings his lead. The master put the lead onto Raja's belt, and the master he hold the other end of the lead. You can see here in the picture. So this one is the lead rope rassi, and the master is holding the other end, and they are going for a walk. Then he takes his cane and says, "Come on, Raja." Raja start off, and his master follows him. And after that, the master he take his can. Here, this one is a can, can stick. And says to Raja, "Okay, Raja, come on now." Then Raja he start off. Raja he goes first, and his master follow him. The good dog takes his master across the busy road of the city. He also takes him in and out of lanes and street. Raja Raja is a very good dog so he take care of his master while crossing the busy road of the city road means uh, rasta or what called sarat yes so raja he always takes his master to cross the road of the city and he also takes him in and out of the lanes and street lanes means galiya and street street is also sarat Raja is a well trained dog. He knows when to stop on the road and when to move on. So Raja Raja is a well trained. Well trained means sikhaya hua, achhi tarah sikhaya hua, achhi tarah train kiya hua dog. So he knows when to stop on the road and when to move. He waits when he see a car coming. He let the car pass then he crosses the roads. He tries to take care of his master all the time. So whenever he see Raja, he see any car coming, he stop. He wait for the car to pass, and after that he cross the road. He tries to take care, good care of his master all the time. When they get back home, the blind master has his dinner. He then rest in his chair. Raja sits by his side. So after the walk, when they get back home, his blind master he has his dinner. Dinner means rat ka khana. So he take rest in his chair. Rest means aram. 
so his deck rests in his chair and Raja sit by his side. His master, oh sorry, the master pet, pets him. Then he gives him a nice bone saying, You are a fine and faithful friend, Raja. The dog is pleased and licks his master's hand. So the do the master, Raja's master, he pets him. Pets means P-A-T-S. Pets means thap thapana. And then he gave him a nice bone. Bone means haddi by saying, You are a very fine and faithful friend. Faithful means wafadar. You are a very fine and faithful friend, Raja. After hearing this, the dog, Raja, is very pleased. Pleased means present khus. And licks his master hand. Licks means to pass the tongues over. Chatna, as you have seen many dogs, they, whenever they are happy, they lick their master. So, likewise, the dog, he licks his master's hand. So, now this is the end of our chapter. Dear student, you go through this chapter, you read this chapter and if you find any difficulty, you can ask me. So thank you and have a nice day.